So, hi guys! This is Gloria once again and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And yes, I'm back for another video. And for today's video, I will be sharing with you my experience on my online education. How much the tuition fee, the process of enrollment, and what course I am taking. But before that, please don't forget to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and please don't forget to tap the notification bell so that you will be getting updated every time I post a video just like this one. So if you're ready, let's get started. I can't forget the day we met, your eyes so blue, mere person through. I can't forget the day we met, your smile so bright, it made me small. I love is like a summer's day, hot sun and less in a magic way. Whenever I see you, all I can think is my summer love. Been waiting for you, my love. My summer love. Been waiting for you, my love. I can't forget the day we met. You look so fly in your red corvette. Your hair. Yes, guys, I am currently studying at AMA Online Education. Um, I'm taking Bachelor of Arts in Psychology. Um, so far, maganda naman yung services ng AMA. Um, I'm only now waiting for my second term kasi um, before you enroll the second term, you have to wait for your 50 days residency. But and the subject, it's up to you kung kailan mo tapusin. You have at least 98 days to finish the one term. But kung, mas ma, kung mabilis mo siyang na, natapos, one month or, or two months mo siyang natapos, you have to wait for 50 days before you can proceed for the next enrollment. Kasi maraming nagko-complain sa mga, ka, mga classmate ko, mga A-classmates ko, maraming nagko-complain bakit daw ang tagal ng enrollment for the second term. Which is, hindi nila alam na they have to wait for 50 days para makapag-proceed for the next enrollment. Kasi yun yung policy ni Ama na you have 50 days residency if maaga mo siyang natapos but yung term is you have to finish it for 98 days so since so since online na siya um, you can finish it one month it's up to you kung ilang ano ilang buwan mo siyang tatapusin but yung maximum time nila is 98 days pag natapos mo siya ng 98 days good. Pag sumobra ka, you have to pay for extension. Kasi 98 days lang talaga siya. But if you have a valid reason naman, you can ask for extension. Pero syempre, may, may, may bayad yun. So, yun po siya. And then, paano ba kayo mag -e enroll Later, i-ano ko kayo sa ano ko, sa screen ko. Ipapakita ko sa inyo yung process ng enrollment. And then, yung tuition fee, let's talk about the tuition fee. Yung tuition fee na Manila is 2,000, 2,500 minor subject. 2,500 for the minor subject and 4,000 for the major subject. So, it's, com compare sa ibang school is, may, um, tama lang kasi, nag-inquire ako sa CAP, yung per unit nila is 1,000, which is, ang isang subject ay umaabot ng 3 to 4 units. So, if tatlong yun, if 3 units yung isang subject, you have to pay for 3,000. Which is sa AMA is per subject, you have to pay only for 2,500. Pero, apart from the tuition fee, meron pa kayong babayaran na platform fee at saka yung admission fee. Yung platform fee nila is 1,700 at yung admission nila is 500 or 300. Nakalimutan ko na siya kung magkano. So, yun po. And then, yung, yung, so yung AB psychology naman is so far so good. Medyo mahirap lang siya kasi yung sinasabi nila, yung misconception about psychology is if you don't like math, um, you have to take psychology, which is very wrong kasi may math kami. And it means sa first term mo, you have math in the modern modern world and then if you have bridging program, kasi like you you graduated 
2017 below, you have to take uh, bridging. May mga bridging program silang in offer, which is uh, five subjects din ata. Yun, it's depend, depend di at depend di sa course na kinuha mo. So, sa amin is limang subject yung BP namin. So, yeah, you have to take the what and same price lang sa ano sa ibang mga subject namin sa psychology. And, may math siya. Don't say na walang math yung psychology because we are struggling for the math. <laughs> Difficult. Maraming nagsasabi na madali lang siya. But, Let's break the one. It's so difficult po. Mahirap po yung psychology. Ding misconception about psychology na oh you're taking psychology you can read my mind. No. We're not uh, we're not studying about the how to read minds. We're studying about human behavior and mental processes. We are studying about human behavior. So yun po yung ano namin having a tutorial kung paano mag-enroll sa AMA online education and it's all legit guys and marami na siyang testimonial na marami nakapagpunta sa Canada that's why I am taking this because of uh, I failed to comply all the requirements for Canada <laughs> so yeah because they required 72 units and I got 24 units only so that's why I have to take risk I want to uh, invest because if you have a uh, goals, you have to invest for your goals. So there's no such thing windfall. Wala po sa madaling. You have to uh, do some hard work in order for you to achieve your goals. So yeah, that's why. Prime Minister Sabi, why it's too late already? But education is not too late. It's not too early. Uh, it's depend on you if you have goals in your life then go for it for so it and ama online education is um opportunity for everyone who doesn't want to leave their job 2019 until the pandemic comes and then become online education become the new normal which is ano na siya sa lahat uh, marami ng school na go offer na online so yeah if you are planning to pursue your dreams your goals then uh, if your education is not enough to comply the requirements for your goals, then better go for AMA online education because you can study at your own time, at your own pace. You can graduate anytime you want to graduate and yeah, it's up all to you. So that's it guys and I will take you to my screen. So if you want to enroll to AMA uh, online education is you have to go to amaido.ph ito po just click nyo lang yan and then yan po siyang yan po yung nakalagay online enroll yan po yung mga offer nila Piliin nyo lang po yung, may pagpipilian po kayong computer, college of computer studies, college of engineering, college of business administration, college of arts and sciences, master's degree, doctorate degree, high school, and online education. Since yung pipiliin nyo is online education, click nyo lang po to, and then yan na po siya, then yan po siya. And then, click nyo po itong visit. Tapos, uh, dito po kayo mag-apply para makita nyo yung ano. Um, click nyo po itong apply. So, since nakapag-ano na ako, nakapag-register, ito po yung magiging itsura ng dashboard nyo. Ito po yung magiging <coughs> ito po yung magiging itsura ng dashboard nyo. Tapos, ayan yung profile. Tapos, yung enrollment. Ito po siya. Since nag-enroll ako last 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 month. So, Ito po, tapos yung payments, kung saan kayo magbabayad ng payments. 
Diyan po. Click nyo lang yung statements of accounts. And then, may option dyan kung ano yung... So, since wala akong outstanding balance, so, zero-zero na sa na po siya. And then, punta kayo sa courses... Ito yung nag-enroll ako. Pag after nyo mag-enroll, at ang kapag na kayo ng payment, active na yung subject. Ito. Tapos, puntahan nyo siya sa my LMS. Diyan po. Tapos, ito na po yung mga subject nyo. And then, click nyo lang yung subject. Tapos, ganito na yung mangyayari. Ganito yung itsura ng ano niya. Subject. Ayan. Tapos, click nyo lang. Dapat nakacheck yan lahat pag tapos na. Tapos, ayan. Then, may final exam. So, ganito po yung itsura. And then, balik tayo sa... Ito po, may nakalagay siya na... Ano... Pag complete na kayo, may nakalagay na 100% complete. Yan po. Yan. Yan siya. Yan sila. And then, ito yung mga kasabayan nyo, mga online students. Ito po. Ito po sila. So, ito po yung itsura ng dashboard ng AMA Online Education. So, so far, okay naman siya. Tapos yung palisi ng Ama, is makikita nyo sa handbook. Dito, college handbook. Tapos yan, yung mga policies, yung mga grading system. Yan. Yan po, mga laboratory. Basta lahat ng mga uh, policy about sa subjects. And dito po, sa school. And dito po. So, yeah. Yan po siya, guys. So that's all for today's video guys and I hope you enjoy watching and see you again in my next one. Bye!